Hello William uh, this is Abhilash and uh, I'm from south part of India and uh, we are into precious metal refinery for the past uh, 12 years and now it is like um, we started this unit as a backward integration for our uh, from our jewelry retail so we started this refining unit for uh, silver refining electrical cables and uh, which is used in the telecommunication which is used in the railways which is uh, used in the ship ship building and those uh, type of communication is very much uh, reliable only with the uh, presence of silver they were actually uh, because it, f- according to them it was the conventional refining what they were following and obviously they were having a huge huge amount of nox they might they might be having a huge amount of nox inside the plant so when they come here they didn't uh, they they were not experiencing any kind of nox here and uh, out of our flush uh, tank and uh, the silver powder used to uh, filter get filtered from the flush tank and that part when the solution is flowing they were like doing this they were smelling literally with this uh, with the hands so it was like uh, for them they they were not experiencing even in little amount of nox also in the plant inside the plant uh, running so it was a great experience with uh, what we have uh, seen like uh, it was uh, good to see them <laughs> act like that i never uh, heard about this uh, preferential leaching method anywhere so when i came to know about this first it was like uh, how can we uh, leach one metal with the presence of other metal so it was very shocking for us and we uh, we were uh, we are one of the example for uh, the preferential metal leaching every once in a 10 minutes of cycle we keep on getting the silver powder that is pure silver powder of 99.99 percentage so once in a 10 minutes we used to get the silver out and we wash that with the hot water and it directly goes to the melting once all the reco- silver has been recovered from the emew plant uh, we get we deplete till 2 grams per liter and apart from that after that the solution goes to the polishing cells the polishing cells recover 100 percentage of silver out from it so 100 means very small ppm very maybe till 5 ppm we refine that uh, uh, using our polishing cells and after that once all the silver is out from from the polishing cells the whole solution goes to the copper plant and we recover copper from it and apart from that we have other impurities little like zinc and cadmium so once that gets uh, accumulated and all the we get all the copper in 49 oxygen free um what you're telling me is is that you take the solid form of waste in in di- different various mixed forms and you then take that solid waste and digest it turn it into a a liquid and dissolve those metals into that uh leach solution and you can do it in such a way to preferentially uh target a metal of interest and try to uh minimize the presence of other metals which can inter- interfere with the recovery process is is that a, a, yes, a yes, correct summary right. for you that's right that's right yeah advantages what i see is uh, the nox presence or the impurities the it is a safe uh, atmosphere where employees can work here and apart from that other other technologies where it is open bath for refining with the conventional plates where it is very unsafe for the people who are working around 
and uh, they get uh, uh, used to work with a higher concentration of solutions but over here it is not the higher concentration it is a uh, around 50 to 80 less than 100 grams per liter solution so it is even the acid will, so, will also be present less and the uh, metal concentration will also be less so it is a good opportunity for any kind of technical people who are working around or it is a good place to for the even the low end laborers to work around so it is good uh, when health wise when compared uh, it is very advantageous for them and apart from that um, with the uh, material spillage also even if there was any kind of leakages the loss will be more in the conventional type and over here it is not so that is a very big advantage and with respect to the precious metal recovery with the um, lower concentration we can achieve the lower concentration and it is very hard to achieve in the conventional type